bigger, man. Yeah, that was all so squonk. They were so tiny in comparison. Like, when you think orcs, you think, like, seven-foot-tall muscle mountains, not whatever the hell those were supposed to be. They were like moblins, like from the classic uh, Zelda anime yeah. or cartoon. Or hell, just Zelda in general. In any case... Well, they changed how they look. Okay. True. Hello, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Dark Alliance 2. I'm your host, the Game of Darius, and with me is Link. Hello. Uh, we have found a, temp uh, a medallion for Tempest, and now we're going to go in here and hope that there's a boss fight. You know, the Dark Alliance is just the Alliance of Goblins. I, you know, yeah. I don't know, because the big bad guy, in case no one was one, in case anyone was wondering, it's the goddamn white armor clad dude who is totally not a vampire. I think we have to check That's out the rest of the place. Who is totally not a vampire. Totally yeah, I'm sure he's a necromancer. Uh... He can't have just decided, oh yeah, I'll take over this large goblin army. Like, yeah, I'm pretty sure that he supplemented it with a little bit of his Are you own... Left? Supplemented it with a little bit of his own undead prowess stuff, but come on. And... You know, vampire... Really? Hi. You take the hellhounds, I'll kill the goblin. <laughs> Uh, I think there's nothing else in this way. I mean, I guess you kind of just get, just take the hand you're dealt with. Like, if you're taking over an army and it happens to be goblins, then by Jove, you guess you got yourself a goblin army. Let's check this room again. I don't know if we checked it for a lever. Mm, I see no lever. Okay, just wanted to make sure. Yeah, yeah. No backtracking. I do something with that army. Turn them all into ghouls or something. Vampire goblins. Yeah. Yeah, vamp goblins. Goblins. <laughs> it gets worse the more we condense it. Vamp. Okay. And bugbears. Uh... Uh, am I swinging or not here? I think you got like stun locked. Seems like it. I think I was stun locked by the hellhound. Which kind of blows. Hey, do blow fire. Open the chest. Yay, Wait, pass them all over the Fire ring or something? Ooh, fine uh, ring. Fine ring. I can only hope it was a fire ring. Because then we could break it down for Jasons. Oh, get off the wall! Actually, no. If it was a ring of resi resist fire, would it have been a pearl? Uh, no. I'm not. I, I don't I remember. Don't, I don't know. There was something that gives you resistances. I don't want to uh, what. Okay. Now the goblin should be gone because it's a new enemy type. Uh, Take that. Wake and dream. You know, it probably comes to my attention that... Oh no, there's got to be a, like a shortcut up to the... Uh, this is fine. <laughs> this is what we signed up for? I mean, I, I guess I got my spirits up when I had seen the Manticore, or not Manticore, the Chimera. I thought to myself, yeah, yeah, we're going to get some more inventive enemies. Oh, I mean, at least the troglodytes were different. And one second. Try it down here for a sec. There's little cornery bit. 
I don't know if it's another room I'll play or... It. <laughs> a bunch of arrows just fly into you. I only managed to do like one one hundredth of my health. Oh, there is a lever. Pull the lever. I'm not your cronk. Hello? Hmm. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I'm realizing our error. I left a crate over here. Okay. Don't you be gurgling at us, monsters. Ah, fucker. <laughs> Can't see myself. C come, come on, go through the door. Can I not serious? One second, let me let me try from. Are you serious? Okay. No, we can't push them through the door. Try it, hit the lever and then hit it off again. I don't think that it's going to close. Yeah, I can't hit the lever again. Okay, there we go. I can push it out. Yeah, I don't think we can push it through, though. Well, highly disappointing. Oh, come on. I... There's plenty of space to jump there. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Maybe we're overthinking this and that this path will go around to it. Okay. He says, Yeah, let's have that crate too. Confidence. How about we just pile up the bodies of goblins? Alright, let's not destroy the barrels. Oh! Sorry! I can't help myself. This is why we're in the predicament that we're in. Well, it looks like it's going to circle around. Alright. Goblins. Yeah, it oh. looks like we overshot it. They're all freaking shaman ones. <laughs> He's on fire and on ice and <laughs> poison. <laughs> uh. Oh. oh my god, it hit the bastard. Okay. Yeah, we severely overthought that. Um. Oh. That's that goblin trying to cast spells at us over here. As he hides in the corner and dies. I hate goblins. <laughs> Alright, so clicking on all the things. No, no. Maybe there's Can a lever. There here? might be a lever over here. I'm just clicking. Really? Yes. Because <sighs> now they gotta put hellhounds in there, too. Look, it's not a well-designed dungeon, but God damn it, it's a dungeon with hellhounds in it. All right, that's all. Those now, <laughs> now we can destroy those barrels. No barrel left alive. Oh my god. Seriously though, they're okay. The next floor for sure. <laughs> There's other, far more interesting low-level monsters you guys could be using. Kobolds. Like, kobolds are my favorite, because they're... I mean, goblins are fine to a point, but man, they just don't do anything else. Yeah. Or hell, just make it so... I don't know. Like, maybe this is me thinking as, you know, the DM of Forever Time. But make it so as they do something interesting? Oh, they throw the shaman ones in there every now and then. That's as about as interesting as they get. I don't know. Like, make ones that are, oh, hey, here's a pit trap or something, and I'm going to taunt you in front of said pit trap, and then, you know, do damage. Something mildly incapacitating. Maybe undead dragons, or <laughs> undead uh, goblins. We had undead pirates. Why not? 
That'd be great. That'd be fantastic. Shield. Can you not be doing this? Wow, you just caved your- you put yourself in a bad place, little goblin. Hell of a failed stealth check. That's for sure. Oh, it's gonna be another one of those. Either pop a lever or open a door and suddenly other things. Beasts from hell! Even with breathing fire, they're not that much of a threat. I mean, they can stun lock you a little bit, but other than that, yeah. Alright, let's see what's in the thing. Let's see what's in the thing. No mimics. I guess that's a plus. Ooh, I got a fine great axe. I got a remarkable spear. Sapphire. Oh, oh. Uh, gloves. <laughs> that moment where you get your hopes up. <laughs> I'd spend this entire dungeon. <laughs> God damn it. Now that I think about it, uh, both Melody Rose and I had done playthroughs of Baldur's Gate. I think Mel is still going through hers because she had school and whatnot. She had the Dragon Spear DLC. Mm -hmm. I really need to watch that back and see what the hell the actual story of this place was. Oh, oh sorry. <clears throat> now you may save. <laughs> nah. Uh, let's get... Oh, that's not a real spear? I thought that was a real spear. Nope. Just... Goblin spear. We be bugbears. At this point, we're only slightly better to fight than goblins. If it was all bugbears, at least that would be something better. Yeah. Some For one, something a little oh, bit that's easier new. to hit. <laughs> Do you want to use fires, little goblins? Oh, you're still alive. Yeah, I was kind of surprised myself. <laughs> <Never mind. laughs> After how many flame strikes like that? Oh, jeez, of course they have to have a giant fiery pot in the middle of the room. I drank the pot. I don't sure think you drink delicious. pot. Well, you drink from it. This, this is, is a foraging area. Yeah. Imperial dagger. Imperial hand, hand axe. Well, again, maybe it's one of those places where the Zintarum had rested up before getting themselves killed by something. I think that was where all their tents were. Or before they went to hell. Ooh, we popped well. I kind of want to say that one of these might lead up to that little... Okay, I think it should be at a point where goblins can't block two level 15 adventurers. <laughs> oh, there's the Why is the oh, anvil away from the forge? Never mind, I'm not going to get into this. Because the forge is too hot. Don't talk to me. <laughs> With your nonsense. <sighs> Frick. Frickity, 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 frick. So, it's a giant labyrinth of I don't know, this place... I mean, it's supposed to be a dungeon. I guess. I guess you gotta forge chains. The only thing I can think of is, like... Maybe they make it so as the chains are permanent. The only thing... Like, you have to super force them off with a hand, hammer and anvil. That's the only thing I can think of. Stop moving. Amulets. Lots of amulets. 
Oh, whoops, I was looking at you. Haha! You shall explore this place thoroughly and slay every goblin and bugbear that we see. <laughs> Eventually, we'll make a debt in the population. <laughs> You have slain 0.01% of goblins all over Faerun. That would actually be a pretty impressive thing to pop up. Nope, I, I keep looking. Get no, in the I door. would not doubt if there's some sort of canonical thing of how many goblins are in the realm, and then if they had remade this game. Oh, hello. This hmm. seems. Oh, never mind, it's more goblins. <laughs> <laughs> Like, it looked ominous for a whole five seconds, and then I saw the goblins behind the walls, and I'm like, just, oh. <laughs> you tricked us again. Yeah, you you got her hopes up. Thought they were doing something clever. More goblins. Push the lever. The tomb door is now open. <sighs> Hey Link, do you think it's that means the that there's? Door. Do you think that means there's gonna be something other than goblins? <laughs> Goblin lich. <laughs> I will take it. <laughs> that would be kind of interesting. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I so I'm guessing this up is going to be back to top side. Yeah, up is where we came from right now. This way oh. is where we gotta go. I thought um, that was going to be a new up. Hello, oh. Doom! <laughs> it's not goblins! Oh, wait, there's one more over here. Aha! Ah. Uh -huh. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Okay. Was that worth the 16 gold? Pretty much. This is the most damage we've taken Ooh. in a long time. Uh, okay, here's the thing. There's these, Okay, caverns. But there's also something further to the west there. Mm, all right. Because <laughs> I, I know one of them is going to be go to topside. Yeah, that's my thinking, too. Actually, should we be worried that there's a uh, casket that's open? Uh, yes. But I really Oh, wait, wanna... what if that was... Oh, what if that's the Vampire Lords, where he was from? The Vampire Vampire one? The... Yeah, the uh, one dressed all in white with skulls? Yeah. That'd be kind of cool. Maybe he was a lord of this manor. But no, we're here for the... Brazier... thing. I don't... Oh. Nope. I already have all I can carry. <sighs> We knew it was coming. It had to it had to happen sooner rather than later. Uh, I was waiting for you. Uh, what do you still have to offer? Just was just want to sell all this crap. There's so much crap down there, sir. So much goddamn goblinoid crap down there, oh. you won't believe it. A plus three superior staff. But if I break this down, I don't get anything, right? Correct. That is lame. Oh, what's that? You guys want to make a profit? Too bad. My shop carries the finest armor and weapons. The work of local Let's see. As well as imports from and I'm almost done. I don't need many, that many rejuvenation potions. I definitely don't need that many lesser healing potions. I don't ever need that um, many lesser rejuvenation potions anymore. Do you want like about 10 of these? <laughs> Maybe 19 of these? I'm wondering how many <laughs> regular... I could take 19 of them and they would allow, that would allow me to reduce my stock of these. There we go. Alright, I just gotta check my amulet situation. Oh. Flawless is really good, Imperial's good, Remarkable's better. Armor and the work of local master as well as 
as imports from Waterdeep and Arm. Okay, fine is trash. Yes. Right. Fine. Shoddy. At this point, fine is trash. Whatever. I don't care. I'm I'm done. I can't even. All right, come over here a little ways. Post, post, potions up the potion up the wazoo. Post, post, potion, potions, potions up the wazoo. All right, ready? <laughs> back to the back to goblins. <laughs> back into the pit. If you want to go the darkest dungeon route. All right. Yeah, and... we lose. Oh, no, there it is. No, that Halberd's back. The shit. Okay, cool. So no, we, we lost... did lose two pieces of armor. <sighs> Alright. All we want is a little consistency game. Hello, Hound. Hello, Hound. Hello, Hound. Doesn't have the same ring to it. Less friendly sounding than Hello Kitty. Oh, yeah, I think this was a place of vampires. I don't know what you're talking about. It's just a casket with a cross on it. Great. Nope, those pauses. I think you need to get your eyes checked. I, dude, it was below like the horizon of the screen. It's Man, horizon, okay. Look at these totally not vampire caskets. Man, we're gonna have to find some vampires. Well, which is better? Oh no! Back to the goblin vampires. Let's do it. Okay, this was just a dead end, but it had loot, a fine chain helmet. Is that chain helmet better than mine? Probably I, it's chain. No. No, never mind. Chain helmet. Not better than a magical leather helmet. Studded leather. Magic's weird. Where oh, that kind of looked like it was a trying, like one of those zigzags. Oh, I gotcha. All right, now we can go back the way we uh, Aren't you glad, though, glad that we... Well, we know there's more vampires around. <laughs> we got more lore. But aren't you glad, though, that at the least we made sure that we had uh, maximum carrying capacity available for when we do go down into those caverns? <laughs> and we sell all this, like, 50 gold shoddy armor. It's yeah. So much random, just shoddy 50 gold, 100 random gold crap. I can't believe there's still going to be a third chapter after all this. I know. I'm trying to remember what the third chapter was all about. Is a dragon fight. Just one solitary dragon I, I fight, just, chapter three. Just give us a dragon fight. After all of this, the least we can do game is give us a goddamn dragon fight. Oh, we gotta wreck what's your face. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping is the dragon fight. Give us two dragon fights. One's the boss and one's random. We like random dragon fights. Give us give us random dragon fights. That looks kinda weird over there. Uh I think this place is some sort of magic-y. does look mm. weird. I do confer the weirdness. Hello? Alright, there shouldn't oh. be goblins. There should be something unique. Bats! Bats! Oh, I'm... It's, it's not goblins, but man... <laughs> it's bats! But yeah, we're in the Underdark. What do you get the creatures in the Underdark besides bats? Oh, you know what? Goblins yep. with bat wings. That'd be interesting. Get were, off the stag type. You were some sort of stuck there. You think maybe that well in the back there actually leads to the Underdark? I hope not. I'm just trying to think <laughs> that'd of... Be a, that'd be a very deep well. Yeah. It's like Dude, let's not even fight feet. the bats unless they actually get close to us. Aha, we wandered in the plot. That's no. a Drider. Oh my god, Driders! Driders! Run away! Or <laughs> 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 run away! Other one, forward! <laughs> <laughs> ah. Oh, Driders! Oh my god! <laughs> shattered into so many oh, pieces. Aw, oh, dude, I swear one day I want to get us into the same room playing my Xbox and playing D&D &D Heroes. There are just so many good, actually 
good monsters right, that I don't on. think I wanna... anyone uses. Why are <sighs> there dead what? drow here? I'm, here, I'm trying to like, figure dragon. out what they're... No, but they're under their control. Get off the things! As it. Uh, there's a little bit of a path back behind us, but... Oh, like, Loth makes driders out of drow that are just crappy drought. Yeah, I thought they were, like, cursed by them. They are, but they're and still, like, under like, the control cursed and then banished or some shit. No, they're used as slaves. Or, you know... And what do you think that slaves typically do against their owners? They myrtle them. <gasps> the crap is that? No! Kill it! Kill it! Kill it faster! <laughs> kill it more! I don't like oh, how that moonstone. looks. Hey, Moonstone! <laughs> kill it more! <laughs> no, I'm not piercing. Dude, I hate oh, the wait. floor on this place, oh, man. I can't. I keep getting caught. I forget what no, they I thought they were called. called like piercers or pincers or something. Oh, because piercers. I thought they count in the ceiling, though. Piercers were the ones that fell off the ceiling, yeah. Okay, that one's dead. <laughs> Not dead enough. You only say that because they're making creepy spider sounds. Pretty much. <sighs> oh, man. <laughs> well, at least we're I... finally out of goblin territory. Seriously. Oh, no. Oh, Jason. Ooh. Just hanging out. Yeah, just... Even I'm getting stuck on those like tights, like mites, whichever one. Tights, they're they're if they're up top, they're tight. It, okay. This top is tight. Ah, God, it's so gross. I thought this thing was also supposed to have tentacles. Oh, is it a roper? That's the name. Thank you. Okay, I thought it was something. Okay. Because they also appear in... As soon as it sounds form, it's like tentacles. I'm like, oh, yeah, I know what that is. I don't... <laughs> don't want to know what that is. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yes. Is this one of those Man. places where we're officially going to beeline to the exit? I mean, it's at least they're not goblins, but man, we are still just wrecking them. Yeah, it's, it's just, I'm so glad that it's something that's not goblins. It's something actually cool. Cool and terrifying. <laughs> like, I'm waiting for some other underdarky creatures, like... I'm waiting for them to drop something. Like, a frogamus? Oh, no, Umber Hulk. I think frog myths are actually more recent, now that I think about it. You know, there are deep gnomes, too. They're not that yeah. nice. It's Rurf Neblin, or I think they were called. Ropers! Yeah, ropers! Man, that's a lot of them. <laughs> I don't even care. They block most of my... Most I got it! Don't, don't help me! Attack sometimes. Right, cool. I had to prove it to myself. <laughs> Did I see something... I Did you see something, something over here? No, I thought I saw something like pop up like another gem, but... Uh, well, there's a little bit of something down here that we missed. Probably more ropers. Or drivers. Probably dead... No, well, we got that one. Dumb. Like how we're complaining. Oh. Just nothing but stupid bats and then just nothing but Trider. <laughs> Trider as far as the eye can see. Dude, at this point, we... Stop blocking! We haven't even touched the amount of... Uh... Driders that we could have slain in Goblin Thank you. in the first area. Ah. Uh, ooh, treasure chest. I'm... Oh, that... Uh, dude, that puddle! It's deep! Yeah. Holy shit. Ah. Where's the treasure chest? Oh, no, never mind. I thought it was... It was oh. this box. Back this way a little bit, there's, um... Back the way we came, I think that is? There's a the little path. The path we didn't choose. Yes. Oh, God. Things that may sometimes make me wish that we'd do longer episodes. My elated 
feelings about fighting something other than goblins right now. I just I just want to have that go out through the entirety of this episode as we slay more dragons. I just, just want to savor it. Oh, our ropers. Ropa. God, that would have driven me nuts if I didn't remember ropers. I think it's just the lack of whirling tentacles. Yeah. Like, oh, I saw that. I think I picked it up. Okay. Because I think they're just random gems here and there. Seems like it. I don't mind. I like that. Uh, let's head up to that other save spot and then I guess we'll call it an episode. Ah. Mykonids. We could be facing off against Mykonids. Are they plant-based? Mushroom people. Okay, so yeah, that's what I was thinking. Get out of here. Maybe that's what these guys are. Just not talking. The Ropers? <laughs> no, the mushrooms that are poisoning us. Oh. <laughs> Man, now I'm just thinking of other mechanics. Like, if they did eh, have, eh. like, the mushroom people and whatnot, they could have it so as their screechers, which, you know, get too close to them and or move too fast to them and suddenly it's just screech and then there's, like, a dozen... Did we go down that way? No. That's what I'm oh, saying. Cool. We... Hit this save point, call an episode, then we'll proceed down that path. Aye. <sighs> Damn it, just so many things I'm now expecting to face off here in the Underdark. <laughs> <laughs> Don't I worry, next level, more goblins. <laughs> no, no more goblins, uh, please. God, anything but more goblins. Underdark goblins, they're just little grayer. <laughs> I will throw myself out the window, which will drop me a whole five be feet, but, you know, the implications... Just throw yourself out the window, dust yourself off, come back in. I needed that. Alright, thank you everyone so very much for watching. Uh, when we return, more Underdark, less goblins. Hope you guys are enjoying this as much as we're enjoying playing it. And as always, hope to see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Cheers. Helm, hear my voice. Please find <laughs> Come on! We're barely away for, uh, from 10 seconds. Come on. <laughs>